Ninasubiri wimbo wake Judith Philip pamoja na Sifa Eli. Na Judith Philip ndiye mgeni wetu siku ya leo hapa katika kipindi cha utukufu. Again we are all about manifesting God's glory. Weza kuzungumza pamoja nasi upande wa Facebook Mwangaza TV upande wa SMS 22914. Kwa wakati huu nimpe fursa hii Judith Philip aweze kuwa kitu salimu ndipo sasa tuweze kuwa tunaendelea. Karibu sana hapa Mwangaza TV. Asante na shukuru. Yes. Yeah, na wasalimu wote wanaotusikiliza wanao tuangalia mm -hmm. uh, kwa majina yangu ni Judith Philip mm -hmm. Judith amezaliwa upande wa mwingi mm -hmm. na ni mwibaji mm -hmm. wa nyimbo za injili amen amen asante sana asante, asante kwa kuja muangaza tv uh, asubuhi ya leo na tunasema ni asante pia kwa kuweza kutenga muda wako kwa mahali hapa tunapoanza pengine ungetueleza Judith Philip amesema amezaliwa upande wa mwingi pengine safari yake ya muziki ilianza wakati ule ama alianza um, hivi majuzi ilianza wakati gani okay uh, story zangu za muziki mm -hmm. zilianza nikiwa mtoto mm -hmm. like nilikuwa napenda kuimba sana mm -hmm. hata nilikuwa naimbia macrusade like naongoza kwa kanisa mm -hmm. hata kwa mashule yeah. lakini nilianza kurekod mwaka wa 2012 mm -hmm. pale ambapo nyimbo zangu azi sikupata the final product mm -hmm. and the final copy mm -hmm. because nilikuwa na record halafu zinafutika mm -hmm. so zilifutika kwa mara kama sita so ilichukua muda kukuja ku release wimbo so wimbo wangu wa kwanza nili release 2016 from 2012 so zikuwa zinafutika almost six times yeah so it was not easy for me imechukua muda na ilikuwa na mwachungu sana because unalipa pesa unaenda una record alafu zinafutika so ilikuwa very discouraging Yeah. Okay. Nini kilikupa ule msukumo wa kuzidi kuendelea kuimba hata licha ya zile changamoto kama hizo nyimbo kufutika and all that. Nili kilikuwa kinakufanya uweze kuendelea. Kilicho nifutia mm -hmm. ni kwamba mimi nimependa nimependa kuserve Mungu. Mm -hmm. Yaani nimependa Mungu nikiwa mtoto. Yeah. Katika familia yetu tumepitia mambo magumu mm -hmm. so ilinifanya sana niwe ukaribu sana na Mungu. Mm -hmm. Na that's why Nili, nilikuwa naangalia pali Mungu ametutoa tukiwa wadogo mm -hmm. nika na nika, nikaona ya kwamba Mungu ana upendo mwingi sana mm -hmm. kwangu na kwa familia yetu mm -hmm. so ilinifanya nitie nitie bidii sana mm -hmm. ni mtumikie Mungu mm -hmm. so siku give up on God because he never gave up on me yes yeah okay yeah uh, ule wimbo wako tuseme wa kwanza ile ambayo ulikupa that first experience kwenye mm -hmm. studio ilikuwa wimbo mgani Uh, umeniokoa bwana mm -hmm. sijai release mpaka leo mm -hmm. kwa nini okay ni uh, among the the songs zinikuwa zinafutika okay. but already niko nayo mm -hmm. but nitaiweka soon mm -hmm. ilikuwa inasema umeniokoa bwana mm -hmm. na umenisamea dhambi mm -hmm. so hiyo nilikuwa naona nilikuwa nafikiria venye Mungu ananipenda mm -hmm. then mimi ali Anasema ya kwamba alinichangua kutoka tumboni mwa mamangu. Mm -hmm. So nikaona ya kwamba hii dhambiu ya Mungu ali, eh, Yesu alikufa kwa ajili ya maisha yetu mm -hmm. ndio atuokoe. Nikaona ni mshukuru kwa kumwambia mm -hmm. umeniokoa. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Judith Philip amefanya nyimbo kadhaa na wasanii ambao tunawajua, mm -hmm. moja wakiwa Sifa Eli, mm -hmm. kuna Steven Kasolo pia yeah. amefanya wimbo naye. Mm -hmm. Pengine tuanze kwa huu wimbo ambao tumeingia nao. Uh, Ninasubiri. Ninasubiri. Mm -hmm. uh, wimbo huo What was the inspiration behind the song? Nini kilikufanya ama ni uliandika ule wimbo ama ni Sifa Eli na mlipatanaje pia naye? Okay, Sifa Eli mm -hmm. mwaka wa 2012. Mm -hmm. Sifa Eli ndio alikuwa amefuma sana ametoa ile wimbo wake inasema ni heri la wama. Mm -hmm. Nilipenda ushuhuda wake. Mm -hmm. Saba baadaye tukakuwa tunaongea. Mm -hmm. So nikamuuliza kama hiyo story ilikuwa kweli. Mm -hmm. Nikaona ya kwamba inalingana mm -hmm. na mali mimi nimetoka mm -hmm. na venye yeye anaeleza mm -hmm. so tukakuwa napenda huduma yake sana mm -hmm. ikakuwa hata kabla hatujamit pia tunaongea kabisa tukakuwa marafiki mm -hmm. sasa nikamwambia uh, siku moja ningependa mm -hmm. tutoe wimbo na yeye yeah. uh, hii song ya ninasubiri inspiration yake ilikuwa ya kwamba kuna vitu ambavyo tumeengojea kutoka kwa Mungu mm -hmm like kuna hadi za Mungu azijatimia maisha ni mwa, mwetu mm -hmm. na anasema ya kwamba uh, lazima nitimize ahadi zangu kwenu mm -hmm. so nilikuwa nakumbusha Mungu tu nimwambia kwamba bado ninasubiri mm -hmm. zile vitu ambazo ujatenda unitendee maumivu ambayo niko nayo 
ulete furaha maisha ni mwangu mm -hmm. mateso ninayopitia bwana utengeneze njia mm -hmm. so ilikuwa song ambayo nilileta idea mm -hmm. na sifa ile tukaongezea sasa lazima juu wa working together yes. tukaongezea sasa mm -hmm. eh okay. yeah. pia kuna wimbo ambao umefanya na Steven Kasolo yeah. na pia ungetueleza ule wimbo the inspiration behind the message na pia vile ambavyo mliweza kuwa mnapatana naye the song the song was about how god never fails us mm -hmm. so katika maisha yetu tunajua kwamba biblia inasema ya kwamba mm -hmm. i will not leave you nor forsake you yes. and you will not be ashamed mm -hmm. when you, you believe in me yes. so it was about venye mungu tu venye umemjua mungu tangia umejua mungu wewe kuna vitu zingine unafanya ziko against mungu mm -hmm. but huyu mungu upendo wake pia hajawahi kuangusha hata siku moja yes. so hata ukifanya nini mungu yuko nawe Awezi akachoka aka na wewe, mm -hmm. awezi akakuacha mm -hmm. na awezi akakuangusha kwa vitu zote. Mm -hmm. Yaani he never disappoint. Mm -hmm. So it was about tulika tuni tuli okay Kasolo ni best yangu sana mm -hmm. ni ni brother yangu. Mm -hmm. So ni ilikuwa ilikuwa tukakutana tuka, nikamwambia mm -hmm. nataka uniambie tutaimba wimbo mm -hmm. kuhusu nini. Akaambia hebu fikiria. Nikamwambia tuimbe Mungu awezi tuangusha. Mm -hmm. Kwa vitu zote tumepitia. Hii ukambani tumekaa, mm -hmm. ukambani ni ngumu, mm -hmm. kila kitu ni ngumu. Mm -hmm. So wacha tuone tuimbe tu, tuseme Mungu ajawi tuangusha, ajawi tuacha. Mm -hmm. So tukaimba hiyo song. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, apart from zile changamoto ambazo umetuambia hapa nyimbo kuweza kufutika. Mm na pengine una changamoto zingine ambazo umekumbana nazo katika safari yako ya kimuziki katika safari yangu ya kimuziki mm -hmm. ni wakati nili release 2016 eh, yeah. the first songs mm -hmm. zenye zilitoka after kuombewa sasa hiyo nilienda kuombewa ndio at least aze kufutika mm -hmm. ziache sasa mm -hmm. sasa nili nilipotoa si kupata any media ya kuplay hizo songs mm -hmm. so unajua in terms of promotion mm -hmm. it it did not do well mm -hmm. so Iyo pia ni changamoto ya kwamba unaona yani media mingi hazikupokei mm -hmm. unaona mm -hmm. kama hujulikani hazikupokei mm -hmm. it is just a process mm -hmm. so ni vizuri pia ukakuwa na patience yes. ukue na patience ndio wakati wakati wa Mungu ukifika mm -hmm. at least utapokolewa kama venye nyinyi mlinipokea mm -hmm. na nashukuru sana kwa hiyo fursa mm -hmm. so yani ni changamoto na pia pesa mm -hmm. kifedha mm -hmm kifedha pia ni changamoto mm -hmm. alafu wakati nilikuwa nafanya lounge na kumbuka vizuri na ile church nilikuwa naenda nilikuwa na na organize like lounge mm -hmm. sasa hiyo siku nimebakisha siku mbili mm -hmm. naye pastor wa hiyo church na organize crusade ndio mm -hmm. sasa ninakosa kukuwa na lounge mm -hmm. so he did that for almost four times yeah. so you can see how it is discouraging yes, eh? yes, yes. so kama ni mtu wa kurudi nyuma mm -hmm. ningekuwa nimerudi mm -hmm. ningekuwa nimerudi kwa sababu hii ndio church ambayo inapaswa kukushika mkono mm -hmm. lakini ukipanga launch ndio maybe maybe usongeze huduma mbele lakini unakwazwa hiyo mm -hmm. siku kuna pangwa kitu ingine kama revivals mm -hmm. and and uh, any event ya church mm -hmm. so you assist is cancelled mm -hmm. e, na ulikuwa umeuliza pasta mm -hmm. so hiyo ni moja ni okay. moja lakini mm. bado uliweza kuendelea bado niliweza kuendelea mm -hmm. but nashukuru Mungu Mungu aliini connect na church na pasta ambaye anaweza shikilia huduma yangu mm -hmm. kwa sababu niko hapa kwa sababu amenishikilia mm -hmm. kwa maombi mm -hmm. pia support yenye ame amenisaidia mm -hmm. nayo mm -hmm. so nashukuru Mungu okay. yeah. pengine yule mchungaji ungeweza kumtambua kwa maana so, ni wa maana sana mm -hmm. ungeweza kukimtambua pengine utaje jina lake na pengine kama kuna watu wengine ambao wamekusaidia katika huduma pia ungeweza kuwatambua na wape shukrani zako kuna watu wengi sana mm -hmm. list ni mrefu mm -hmm. lakini kwanza mchungaji wangu namtambua mm -hmm. kwa sababu yeye amenisaidia ameniombea mm -hmm. hata wakati nilikuwa na event ya, ya music mm -hmm. alinipea tu venue mm -hmm. unajuanga tu venue mm -hmm. watu ulipa mm -hmm. lakini hakunilipisha but alinishika mkono hata akani, akanitolea mm -hmm. akanitolea pesa mm -hmm. so alinisaidia sana anaitwa apostle peter kadhalu mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. eh, kanisa kanisa ya revival and restoration deliverance church mm -hmm. apa fedha tasia mm -hmm. so 
amenisaidia sana mm -hmm. na na nashukuru Mungu kwa kuniunganisha na yeye mm -hmm. maana nipo wa Mungu akakuunganisha na watu ambao wako tayari yes. kwa sab, kusapoti huduma yako ile ingine ni familia yangu mm -hmm. imenisaidia sana mm -hmm. kwa hivyo nashukuru Mungu mm -hmm. na watanzamaji wote ambao wanasikiliza muziki yangu kutoka mm -hmm. YouTube mm -hmm. ni mimi mwenyewe siwezi sikiliza mm -hmm. Siezi hata subscribe. Mm. Subscribe yangu ni moja hata maybe hakuna. Mm -hmm. So wamenisaidia sana na washukuru wote. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Pengine Judith unaandika nyimbo zako kwa njia ina gani? Kuna watu wanasema anaota akisikiza neno pia anaweza kuwa akiandika nyimbo zake. As Judith unaandika nyimbo zako kwa njia ina gani? Okay, kwa njia zenye naandika wimbo. Mm -hmm. Wakati niko deep in prayers. Mm -hmm apo na kwa niko niko yani nakuwa karibu na Mungu sana yes. wimbo inakuja lakini like, sometimes i may be sleeping nime na alafu ni niko in, in mood of prayers mm -hmm. in mood of uh, unaelewa kama kufunga mm -hmm. nini so inakuwa usiku unaona ni kama una dream mm -hmm. lakini au dream mm -hmm. unasikia tu kwa roho mm -hmm. wimbo inaimba tu ndani mm -hmm. ya roho yes. sasa hiyo una, unaamka tu naandika mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. Hapa Kenya najua kuna wasanii wengi ambao pengine ungesema wana uh, the inspire uh, mm -hmm. your music sijui ni watu kama kina nani ambao pia unaposikiliza huduma yao pia unaweza kukibarikiwa. Uh, Kenya peke yake. Mm -hmm. Tunaweza sema Kenya, Tanzania, <laughs> tuseme East Africa. Okay. Mimi Kenya, mm -hmm. Kenya mwanamuziki mwenye okay mimi napenda mm -hmm. tuseme tu kweli ni moja ni Stephen Kasolo wezi fanya kazi na mtu upendi. Mm -hmm. Ndio. Na mtu aja ku inspire. Mm -hmm because of the background yake mm -hmm. na ya pili mm -hmm. tunaweza sema ni tumaini mm -hmm. ni sizame mm -hmm. because tumaini alinishika mkono mm -hmm. at one point mm -hmm. wakati nyimbo zako zilikuwa zinafutika mm -hmm. so huyo ni mwingine juu yeye ni Kenya although ni mtanzania yes. alafu kuna tuseme Anastasia Mkambwa mm -hmm. na Masimasika mm -hmm. okay wanani wanani inspire mm -hmm. tukienda upande wa Tanzania mm -hmm. Rose Mwando mm -hmm. from nikiwa mtoto mm -hmm. alafu Sifaeli mm -hmm. yes yes na tuseme Chris Mwangila mm -hmm. yeah wana wa, okay wana ni inspire yeah, okay. yeah. mm. sawa sawa so in line with that we have a challenge for you mm -hmm. nakimbia sana kwa sababu ya muda mm -hmm. uh, tuko na challenge hapa mm -hmm karatasi tatu <laughs> unapaswa uchukue karatasi moja alafu kile ambacho kimeandikwa hapa utaweza kukitueleza ni nini alafu <laughs> nitakuelekeza nini utakao kifanya lakini unaonekana already unajua where i'm headed <laughs> so chukua karatasi moja moja yes Sawa. Tuambi okay. imeandikwa nini pale? Anastasia. Anastasia mkabwa. <laughs> so unapaswa tuimbie wimbo wake Anastasia ule wimbo ambao unaupenda sana. Napenda Mungu alinena na ye msaizi toeki atu. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Kifue. Mm -hmm. yeah. Ungeendele kidogo. Ah, wacha tuachie hapo. <laughs> <laughs> tuachie hapo. Eh. Okay. Lakini ningependa utuimbie ule wimbo ambao tumeingia nao, wimbo wako pamoja na sifa eli. Pengine ungetunguzia kidogo. Ninasubiri. 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 Ule wakati wangu ninasubiri 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 zile ahadi zako Amen. Amen. Tunasubiri ahadi zake mm. juu ya maisha yetu. Katika safari ya kimziki uh, kuna watu ambao unaweza patana nao and they discourage you. Umesema mm. kuna watu ambao walikushikilia sana. Sijui kama umepatana na the other side of people who discourage you ama wanakuvuta chini. Mm. Umepatana na watu kama wale? Nimepata. Mhm. Mm Nimepata. Wanakuambia nini? We. <laughs> kuna wengine wanakuambia hey, umepiga Mm -hmm. umepiga nini umepiga studio mbaya mm -hmm. endo urudi tena urudie wimbo mm -hmm. ukirudia wimbo itakuwa na high quality mm -hmm. unaona yeah. wengine wanakwambia yani watu wataku discourage tu wanakuwa na like unaanza kitu auwezi fanya mm -hmm. like auwezani nacho mm -hmm. so wanakwambia uwezani nacho hiyo ni pesa unatupa bure mm -hmm. So vitu mob. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay. Yeah. Nikurudisha nyuma kidogo pengine ungetueleza zile nyimbo ambazo unasema zilikuwa zinafutika. Mm. Pengine shida ilikuwa wapi? Ilikuwa kwenye studio ama ilikuwa mashini mbaya? Shida ilikuwa nini? Siwezi sema kama ilikuwa studio, mm -hmm. maana tulikuwa tuna rekodi wengi mm -hmm. na ile time naendea master ni mimi zangu zinafutika. Peke yako. Peke yangu. Peke yako. E, so si mashini ilikuwa mbaya. Mm -hmm. So tulikuwa watu wengi 
na mimi ni mimi ni zangu zilikuwa zinafutika tu peke yangu mm -hmm. eh. mm -hmm. na si kwa producer moja mm -hmm ni different mm -hmm. tunaweza sema watatu mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. mm. ndipo so uliweza kuchukua hatua ya kuweza kuongea yeah, yeah. mm -hmm. so because wakati nilianza kuimba nilishikana na msanii mmoja akamwambia nionyeshe studio mm -hmm. yenye naweza record but unfortunately akuweza aliweza kunionyesha mm -hmm. but pia kuna venye aliongezea pesa mm -hmm. ikakuwa kuna venye ana take advantage mm -hmm. so wakati nili realize pia hiyo ilikuwa changamoto pia it was discouraged mm -hmm. because nilikuwa nime spend more than 80k mm -hmm. yes no, na zilienda hivyo mm -hmm. yeah okay mm -hmm. kuna watu ambao wanakutizama Judith na wanasema ya kwamba mimi ningependa kufika mahali ambapo Judith amefika mm -hmm. ningependa kuimba vile ambavyo Judith anaimba ama ana ni inspire one or the other mm -hmm. lakini ungewaambia nini chenye naweza waambia kwanza ni kukaa katika utakatifu. Yeah. Ni safari kama una utakatifu mm -hmm. ni ngumu sana. Mm -hmm. Because usipokuwa unaenda kulingana na jaza za Mungu, mm -hmm. utakuwa mbali sana na Mungu. Mm -hmm. Na uwezi imba Mungu ambaye uko mbali naye. Mm -hmm. Lazima ukue karibu na Mungu. Mm -hmm. Just walk with God na ukue sana una focus na una focus na mambo ya ya Mungu mm -hmm. na usome Biblia uattend church services hizo mm -hmm. zinakuleta ukaribu sana na Mungu mm -hmm. uh, na pia funga mimi nitasema watu wa fast mm -hmm. <laughs> lakini si ile ya kujiumiza mm -hmm. like hiyo kufast na kufanyanga ukue yani mwili yako inakuwa imeenda tu level nyingine tu mm -hmm. e, unasikia uko karibu na Mungu okay. yeah Okay. Pengine kwa miaka mitano ijayo. Mm. Mm. Kimziki, mm. Judith unajiona wapi? Miaka mitano ijayo. Mm. Where do you want to be? Oh God. Mm -hmm. e, naomba Mungu mm -hmm. <laughs> anipeleke levo nyingine, mm -hmm. anitoe hii levo niko, mm -hmm. anipandishe levo nyingine. Mm -hmm. Like ikue naweza enda kuimba United States of America, mm -hmm. naweza yani kila mahali mm -hmm. worldwide. Mm -hmm. eh? Mungu anipandishe tu level nyingine. Yeah. yeah. International. International. Amen. Amen. Na tunaomba utaweza kufika pale. Eh, amen, Jesus. amen. Amen. Mm. So, uh, ningependa uweze pia ku ongelesha your fans ama mm -hmm. kuzungumza pamoja nao pengine ungewaambia nini na pia kwa wale ambao wamekusaidia sana. Mhm. Mm kuweza kufika mahali ambapo umefika. Yeah. Yes. Okay na waitanga familia because yes. ni part of me mm -hmm. uwezi supportiwa na mtu hata they are more than family yeah. si waitangi fans because they are more than family mm -hmm. family wanaweza kosa kukusaidia but hao watu wako nje ndio wanakusaidia mimi nimesaidiwa na watu wa nje kabisa mm -hmm. so naweza waambia waendelee tu kuni support mm -hmm. at least tupeleke injili mbele yeah. katika nyakati zenye tuko ni za mwisho mm -hmm. na tunahitaji kupeleka injili mbele yes. so chenye na waomba waendelee tu kuni support na, wanyo, na wale wenye wameni support pia mm -hmm. wasinichoke mm -hmm. waendelee tu kuni kuni support yes. yeah okay mm. uh, tunapomalizia ungetueleza upande wa facebook unapatikana wapi mm -hmm. upande wa youtube ndipo sa watu wengine waendelee pia kwa baraka pia kwako yeah kama mm -hmm. youtube sana sana yes, yes. youtube eh, najita judith philip tv mm -hmm hapo utaona tu kisearch utaona nyimbo zangu mm -hmm. unaweza subscribe unaweza angalia like mm -hmm. pia and comment something mm -hmm. na venye unataka nifanye mm -hmm. na chenye umenguzwa nacho mm -hmm. na vile na kuinspire yes. so i will really appreciate mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. so ingine ni ni facebook na mm -hmm. jita judith philip mm -hmm. instagram na jita judith philip kenya mm -hmm. na twitter pia na jita hashtag judith philip mm -hmm de Judith Philip Kenya. Okay. Yes, Asante. Yeah. Asante sana kwa kuja muangaza TV. Tunapomalizia pia ungetueleza one word. I mm -hmm. know an artist nasema anga nyinyi ni watumishi wa Bwana. Yeah. In one or the other but yeah, wewe yeah. ni kama yule mchungaji ambaye yako pale mm -hmm. kanisani. So one word that you would love to leave us with ama utuache na neno moja ambalo litaweza kuwa linatia nguvu ile ambayo unakutizama, mm -hmm. litaweza kuinua yule ambaye anasikia moyo wake umeinama. Mm -hmm. Tunapomalizia. Eh inaitwa Joshua 1:5 mm -hmm. that God will never leave you mm -hmm. nor forsake yeah. you. Aijalishe ya kwamba umepitia mapito gani? Mm -hmm. Aijalishe ya kwamba uko kwa situation gani? Yes. Aijalishi ni mambo mangapi ama mangumu yamekulemea. Mm -hmm. Lakini Mungu ako na wewe. Mm -hmm. Anasema hata kuacha mm -hmm. na atabaki kuwa na wewe kama vile alimuongoza Joshua. Mm -hmm. 
na yeye atakuongoza. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Asante sana Judith kwa kuja hapa Mwangaza TV na kuweza kuzungumza pamoja nasi. Kubarikiwe sana sisi tungeomba kwamba hapo ungelitaka kufika. Umesema you want to be international. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Mungu aweze kukufikisha pale. Amen. In amen. Jesus name. amen. And be a blessing also to others mm-hmm. na wengine ambao pia wangelipenda kuwa kama wewe. Sijui kama kuna watu wawili wa chatu ungependa kusalimia. Kwanza nashukuru, mm-hmm. nashukuru Mwangaza TV. Amen yote kabisa uh-huh. all the protocols observed yes, yes. like asante kwa kunikaribisha mmenipea chance yes. at least ya kuongea na watu mm-hmm. ni ni, ni rare sana mm-hmm. so see, i don't take it for granted yes. so it is just by grace mm-hmm. to go up so i want to thank you mm-hmm. all of you mm-hmm. all the team behind mm-hmm. behind the scene mm-hmm. na washukuru wote ni kwa kujitolea mm-hmm. hii si kazi rahisi yes. i really understand mm-hmm. so Mungu awabariki sana Amen. na wainue kiwango kingine Amen. muende kiwango kingine Amen. zaidi na zaidi Amen. alafu nataka kuwasalimia watu wote familia yangu mm-hmm. that's my mom there at mwingi mm-hmm. eh, pali panaitwa idhumbi mm-hmm. na, na my siblings eh, eh, and familia yangu yote mm-hmm. so nataka kuwashukuru pia my 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 fans 